So far, we have been dealing with discrete probability distributions. There's another kind of probability distribution called continuous probability distribution. Let's see some features of continuous probability distributions. We know if we put probabilities of a discrete distribution in a graph, the probabilities become bars. Their heights represent probability values and add to 1. There are gaps between those bars because probabilities can only happen at certain values. If we put those bars really close together so that there are no gaps between them anymore, this becomes a continuous distribution. We can see that the highest points of those bars form a curve, and we call it a probability density function. Since probabilities can't be negative, all values of a probability density function should be greater than or equal to zero. And the area underneath the curve should be 1, because all probabilities add to 1. In continuous probability distributions, probabilities are areas. The probability of x less than a, is the area to the left of x equals e. The probability of x less than b, is the area to the left of x equals b. The probability of x between a and b, is the probability of x less than b, minus the probability of x less than a. It's the area between a and b. If we bring a and b closer and closer, the area between a and b becomes smaller and smaller. If finally those two lines touch, so that a is equal to b, then the area becomes zero. Therefore we have, px equals a, is zero. This is an important feature of continuous probability distributions. In continuous probability distributions, the probability that x is equal to a particular value, is zero. Remember this important feature because we'll use it later. In this class, we learn continuous probability distributions. In continuous probability distributions, there's a probability density function f of x. It is never negative. Area under the probability density function is 1. Probabilities are areas. px less than a, is the area to the left of a. px greater than a, is the area to the right of a. px equals a, is 0. 